Hey guys, welcome to Location Side. I'm Marcus, music producer, lighting director, and official MA trainer. This is MA Quick Tips. Grand MA3 version 2.2 is out with a long awaited recipe editor. How it works? Let's check it out. First of all, let's open up the new recipe editor menu. So go to Tools, Recipe Editor. And here you can see this magic button, Edit Recipe. Press this button, and now you can see these green icons here on all of the windows. And you can select now the profiles, dimmer, full, preset, red, um, focus, white, and straight. And uh, oh, I would like to make a magenta or a blue. We have now created a few values, which we don't need. We only need the last value. So we can press this clean up button to clean up the list and only take the important um, values, which we need. And press store, hit a new sequence, and this sequence is still stored. Now let's clear it up, hit all, hit, for example, dimmer near and uh, align out. Let's go and make a phaser. So this phaser is now running. If you want to create a speed change for this phaser, then it's easily done here. You can say, let's say, select the speed of 200, for example, and then the speed is faster. Or if I want to have a um, phase, you can use a matrix or input it directly here in the phase from in phase two. Now let's store this again to Q2, as done. Um, select the sequence. Let's check Q1, let's check Q2, and for Q3, I would have them all on in red, for example, the profiles in straight out position, the washer in aligned in position, let's clear one time, washer aligned in position in blue, or let's say we want to have the profiles in a color phaser, so let's start the color phaser, also with a wing of two. And let's press clear up to clear the items, which we don't need. Hit store, press the sequence, and Q3 is stored. And let's create a last queue where everything is still standing, so all of 100% dimmer to blue, white, and straight. This is the last queue, so let's hit store, press here, and now it's stored. Let's have a look if it has worked. Sequence, edit the sequence, and here we can see in Q1 we have successfully created our recipes. In Q2 we have successfully created our recipes Q3 and also Q4. And so this is a very, very quick way how you can work with the recipe edit workflow. Thanks for watching, I hope you liked it and enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. See you next time, bye bye.